video. Look where we are. Back in the kitchen with my favorite people, you guys, doing my favorite thing, cooking. Because today is another episode of Dinner with Kelsey. Let's get cooking. But before we get cooking, you know we have something very important to address. And that is the sponsor of the video. Because these Dinner with Kelsey videos would not be made possible if it wasn't for my favorite people over at HelloFresh. If you have watched one of my Dinner with Kelsey videos before, you know how much I love HelloFresh. HelloFresh is a meal delivery service and they deliver fresh ingredients and seasonal recipes straight to your door. It truly makes cooking and prepping so easy, it eliminates so much stress from your life. You can honestly just like enjoy cooking and learning how to cook and you can make meals in 30 minutes and it's so easy. Plus, all of the meals are absolutely delicious. They have so many recipes and new recipes so you're never like in any sort of rut or anything. You're always whipping up something new. And they make it easy and flexible so that if you need to skip a week or change a delivery date or change your preferences, they make it easy and you can do that whenever you want. You've seen me cook a lot on this channel and you know that I'm not, you know, Gordon Ramsay. I'm not Rachel Ray, but I feel like it when I use HelloFresh because I'm trying things I usually would be too scared to try and I'm using different ingredients and I'm just whipping it up in the kitchen and they make me feel like a successful chef and I say that every time but it's actually true because the meals are so good every single time and I'm like, uh, yeah, I did that. I don't always want to be ordering. I want to cook more and with HelloFresh that actually is possible because I'm saving time and effort, grocery shopping and planning and all of that and I'm just able to cook the meal and do it well and feel successful, you guys. That's that. So if you want to feel like a successful, amazing chef like I do every single time I use HelloFresh, go to HelloFresh.com and use code 12KelseyK to get 12 free meals, including free shipping. Let's be professional chefs together, or feel like them at least. And now, we will cook. So we're getting cooking, people. Today we are making, let me get my bag. Get that bag, sis. Today we are making poison sweet potato and mushroom bowls. And so like, it's all in this perfect little bag. So let's do our, our ingredient haul. We love our ingredient hauls. We have a bell pepper. Next up, ooh, some cremini mushrooms. After that, hello, it's a sweet potato. Here we have some poison sauce. I love poison sauce. I really do. Next up, we got some green onions. Soy sauce. Oh, I'm gonna love this. I'm gonna love this. A little, oh, love this, you guys. Look at this mini sriracha little packet. So cute, a little sriracha. Okay, a little sour cream. Don't mind if I do. What do we have here? A little rice. Jasmine rice, mayonnaise, which always gives me a little bit of the oh, always gives me a little bit of the heebie-jeebies, and I definitely cannot read the ingredients because it makes me want to vom. Sesame seeds, and kind of looks like a heart, like the organ, not like a, you know what I mean? That's like this. Anyway, maybe not. Uh, so, a ginger, ginger. So first things first, we are going to wash all of our produce and chop it up. Chop it up. All right, let's dice this bitch up. Okay, sweet potato done. We're doing it. Nice. Now we're making the rice while our oven heats up for our veggies. I'm coming back in a second, guys. Do not worry about me. I'm just trying to find some not stale butter. Oh my God, this one's also stale. What the fuck? All of our butter is bad. I'm gonna use this one instead. My cooking stress is setting in big time. Butter in. Scallion white. Fuck. In. Boom. Some ginger. <laughs> Stir that all up. Just until it's fragrant, you guys. Beautiful. Then you're gonna stir in your rice. 
one and one fourth cup of water. You want to make sure all that ginger on the bottom is being mixed in. And I don't know, I don't really know what I'm saying. And let's go ahead and just bring that to a boil. Once that's boiling, I'm going to put it on low heat, let it simmer and just cover it and let it simmer. Let's go back over and let's get our veggies ready. We're gonna take care of the potatoes and the mushrooms first. I know it's a little bit messy. That's all, that's what cooking's all about, baby. Our sweet potatoes and our mushrooms. And we're gonna do a drizzle of oil. And we're gonna do half of the poison. Toss this up. Oh yeah, get it all coated up, seals in all the juices. I think I say that a lot. It's from Crazy Stupid Love, if you don't know. Now you know. Some of this, boom. A little bit of that, bow. Mix it up, toss it up, toss it up. So you're gonna wanna put that on a baking sheet. Beautiful, and then you're gonna take your, <laughs> I'm really going to town with these tongs and it's like just not working. Then you're gonna take your bell peppers Okay. Oh fuck, shit, simmering. Oh, that was a close one. You're putting your bell peppers in here, I'm stressed. And then you're gonna do one more little, that was a lot, of oil. And then just some salt and pepper on these pups. Toss those up, get them nice and coated. And then you're gonna place these on the other side. Okay, now we're gonna put these in the oven. All right, folks, so while we do that, now we're getting into the real nitty gritty here. While my rice is, is cooking and my things are roasting, we are making the sauce. We are going to take the mayo, which I'm, I'm actually like not really looking forward to squirting it out of this bag. You know what they say, do one thing every day that scares you. These are literally the worst scissors in the world. They didn't. There we go. So real scissors look like. Okay, squirt your mayonnaise in. Dad, if you're watching, look away. You're okay. Hmm? You okay? Mm-hmm. <coughs> okay, mayonnaise is in. Now we add the sour cream. That just kind of goes everywhere, doesn't it, every time? And then the soy sauce, which is interesting, you know? Boom, soy sauce in, and then some sriracha. And then we're gonna mix that up. All right, oh yeah, that's like, it's probably fucked up, honestly. I probably messed that up, but that's okay. Now, what we're gonna do now, we're gonna take our, our oven mitt. We're gonna take these out. We're gonna take the hoisin, rest of the hoisin, and sesame seeds, and we're gonna put them on here and then put it back in the oven. We're doing this so that we can get a nice glaze. Oh, fuck. Bell peppers get no love. Smells delish, looks delish. I have my bowls. So you fluff up your rice a little bit. Okay, rice in. Okay, you can't even really see it. Okay, so these look delish. Now you're gonna take this sriracha, mayo, soy sauce, sprinkle out on like that. Then you're gonna take your scallies, pop those on top, scallywags, sesame seedalitos. Oh my God, these are beautiful. All right, it is official taste test time. It's Poison mushroom sweet potato bowl. Okay. Well, this looks great. Sheesh. This looks really sheesh, babe. This looks super sheesh. Okay, you mix it up. It looks really good when all mixed together. Cheers. Cheers to the beers. That's what I like to call an, a HelloFresh knockout. Yeah! The peanuts are really creamy. Mm-hmm. What the is sauce that? wasn't as creamy as I thought it was supposed to be, but what is what is in there? Creme fraiche or something? Sour it's cream? Sour cream, mayonnaise, and soy sauce. Sour cream in an Asian dish. I've, I've never heard that before. Have you guys? This is delicious. I should have put the sweet potatoes longer, but holy it's really good. It's really good. I like it a lot. Me too. All right. Well, you guys, turns out that this is in fact another HelloFresh knockout. Babe, can you get out? <laughs> Thank you to HelloFresh. Love you. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. Bye.